Hey guys, welcome back to Vlogmas Day 5. I know I'm late, but better late than never. This video is shambles. It's all over the place. I did um, a wear test for Fenty makeup to see if it was mature skin friendly. And this, uh, this was also immediately following the live stream where I wand curled my hair. Okay guys, so I've done my hair. So I am heading out. This is like great light. <laughs> But yeah, I've done my hair. I actually did a live stream of me wand curling my hair using um, these, what is this, Brazilian Loose Wave hair extensions. I use them to make a wig. Absolutely love it. I actually went ahead and skipped the red lipstick because it just didn't go with the colors I was wearing and instead I'm wearing this plum color by Dose of Colors. Um, I'll put a link to it in the information section below. This is it and I used a little bit of, hold on, <laughs> uh, I used a little bit of this uh, Tartist lip paint um, I received as a sample and something I purchased. So I mixed the two together and I got this color which I thought was perfect uh, for this blouse. So. We're gonna head out. Currently, the face is still holding up really, really beautifully using the Fenty um, foundation and then matchsticks. And um, I'll check in a little bit later. But in the meantime, join me for dinner with Miora. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> All right, hey guys, I am back. It is about six and a half hours later. It's now nine o'clock. I first put the makeup on at 3.30 and this is how it is held up. It looks awesome, really pretty. Um, there really aren't any issues that I can see with the makeup. Hold on one second. Where is my... I'm just gonna grab a mirror really quickly. I'm so tired. I'm so full. You know how you get the itis? That's how I feel right now. All right, so just in looking at the makeup, I'm not seeing any issues with it. Mm, a little bit under the eyes, maybe. Just a little bit of creasing, but not really. Like, nothing to write home about. It's like the perfect matte makeup. Um, I'm the kind of person, I like to be somewhere between m matte and luminous <laughs> and this is like the perfect balance between the two sometimes matte can make you look super super dry um, and then sometimes makeup that's supposed to be luminous on this skin or off of some um, uh, luminosity can be like too oily and this is like just the perfect blend between both so I really like it. I have nothing bad to say about it. I didn't even set this with powder, I just realized. I set the contour a little bit with another contour powder, but um, yeah, I didn't put any powder on, and again, I'm not oily or anything. I just have a nice sort of, um, you know, my skin looks nice, healthy, and you know, moisturized, but it doesn't look super matte. So if you're looking for a super matte product, because I know some people like full coverage, and they like that matte look, this is probably going to work with you if you pair it with a powder, but if you don't set it with anything, you'll just have a nice, natural, um, you know, healthy skin look. If you're looking for something that gives you like this super luminous look, you probably want to use the highlight stick, <laughs> stick, match stick a little bit more for that, and that'll definitely bring that sort of dimension to your face. But if you, you know, like, like um, makeup that has a you know semi matte coverage that also has a very um natural look um a makeup that you could use for no makeup makeup looks but then also to glam up i feel like this is the perfect this is the perfect product for that it's gorgeous <laughs> You're just going to need to find your color. <laughs> That's about it. You're just going to need to write, find the right color for you because there are a lot of colors to choose from. Um, but once you do and you pair them with the matchsticks, I think you'll be really, really happy. So I hope this wear test has been helpful to you guys. Um, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to leave them in the comments section below. Um, if there are other colors or other makeup brands you'd like to see me do a wear test on, then please don't hesitate to let me know in the comment section below as well. As always, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.